Hello guys, hello Chris Naylor back again with a new video and today I'm just so hyped to introduce you guys to my new secret HUD and no, the gameplay you're watching right now is not from that but uh, stay tuned guys however, so recently I've been thinking that my HUD is lacking a bit especially in terms of some editing, free building, turtling mechanics of the game and uh, yeah, I just felt like I've been lacking in skills, especially mechanically, of some other pro players like Mood and uh, Bala, for example. However, I changed it up, so enjoy my new revolutionary, extraordinary pro mobile hunt. <laughs> Yeah, I hope you enjoyed my little montage there, but yeah, let's actually go through the HUD, why I made it and uh, stuff like that. How is it so good? And yeah, so the first thing you probably realize is that there is no open build menu button. Instead, I decided to put in all these smaller buttons that you can open builds directly or take the weapon you want directly. This is similar to like PCP keybinds, if you know, they don't have the open build menu button usually, they just press the build or the weapon that they want right away, which means you can switch really fast between them. Also, this is a 7 finger claw, I decided to add a finger from my 6 finger claw, so now I actually have one separate finger for shooting, one separate finger for editing and one separate finger of taking out a weapon as you can see on the left side of the screen. Before I was shooting and editing with the same finger which you know wasn't really efficient at all. I tried to have this only as a 6 finger claw in the beginning but then I realized that I had to edit and take out weapons with the same finger and that was just way too ineffective. Apart from having those extra small building buttons instead of a build menu and a build menu opener you know it's just a standard 7 finger claw if I could say it like that. Also have an example of a 6 wing claw user which uses the same principle, no open build menu button and these extra separate buttons for each tool. And uh, yeah, here is his HUD, uh, his name is Blade Freespas, shout out to him. And uh, as you can see here, 6 wing claw, he have all of these extra buttons at one place though. I decided to have them on different sides and add an extra finger. You know, I just felt that to be like more comfortable for me. Though that's actually a personal preference which you can choose. The main thing is that you're gonna use six fingers or more and those extra small little buttons instead of a bull menu and a bull menu opener. But yeah, if we go back to my HUD, so I'm just gonna quickly explain which finger does what. So, so my left ring finger is pressing the shoot button, my left middle finger is pressing the edit button, my left index finger is uh, switching between the weapons, and my left thumb is obviously using the joystick to walk around. Now for the right side, my right middle finger is jumping. My left index finger is actually doing a lot of things. It's scoping in, crouching and switching between builds. I will admit that it's maybe not the most effective way to put scope button and crouch button at the same place because you know sometimes you want to crouch and scope at the same time. However, I don't think that's such a big deal. But uh, yeah, the build buttons are there as well, and you don't really, you know, switch between builds and scope in at the same time or crouch, if you get what I mean. So that's perfectly like okay. And of course, with my right thumb, I'm moving around, aiming around the screen. You know, I don't really see this claw have any like weaknesses, to be honest. As you can see here, I'm doing the, you know, shoot, place a floor, and, you know, just keep doing that jumping. And before with my all that, I felt that that was kind of hard, especially when you had to open your build menu and then select the floor. Now you can just select the floor right away, which, you know, saves a lot of time, if I could say like that. Wall replacing, just, you know, in general, switching from a weapon to a build, just really fast. It's just such a huge advantage. I even felt like having these, you know, extra build buttons instead of, you know, opening the build menu just felt so much more like 
effective in a way, so much more fast, controlled. So yeah, I just definitely suggest that you guys should try to use these, you know, smaller buttons a lot more. Implement them in your HUD. This move with, you know, taking out your pickaxe in between, you know, to edit with, kind of felt like a real hard move to do. Because after the edit, when you open your build menu, you usually like, most people have this setting when you open with a wall, and then you just suddenly open with a wall and, uh, you know, you just get stuck there, <laughs> pretty much. But right now with this side, you can just edit and start placing ramps. And if you have seen Mongrel turtle, you can see that he can do some real advanced turtling really fast. And right now, you know, I'm still practicing, I'm still new to this HUD, so I can't really implement that. But sometimes the feeling of just, you know, taking out your weapon really fast and just taking up your bullets really fast is something that you really feel with this HUD, even if you're like a noob using it. <laughs> so with all these examples being said and shown, I really hope that uh, so many of you guys are going to switch to this method. Though, like, it, just saying it right now, you will require six fingers or more for this method to be effective. And in my opinion, for this to be, like, real, like, PC keybinds, I would suggest that you have your buildings on one side and your weapons on the other side. You can go with the six wing claw that Freeze Boss made and, uh, you know, if you feel like seven fingers is a bit too much for you, I understand that. Though, if you wonder why I'm not like a complete noob with the HUD right now, it's because it's still really similar to my old HUD. The right side is nearly identical to it, my old six wing claw. And uh, to be honest, without even exaggerating here, I would say that this is better than like most PC keybinds. Maybe not better than the pros, but like average keybinds, this claw is so much better than it. Like, trust me on that. Also, if you've seen my latest video talking about mobile HUDs versus controller, like, I just want to say right away that this HUD beats, you know, literally all controllers. You know, it's just, it just so good. Trust me on that, guys. And with all these things being said and taught today, I hope you guys will switch to, you know, like, some of these advanced claws, especially if you want to become really good at the game. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video, comment your thoughts on this new claw down in the comment section. And until next time, have a great rest of your day guys.